Right, this is it. Looks quite nice. Morning, the time is 10.52, let me get the lights. I haven't had a bad sleep to be fair, because it's been dark, because I put the shutter down outside. Literally, I stayed on this half of the ping pong table, but luckily the AC was on, so I kept warm. I've definitely had worse night's sleep, but it's just my knee, and my knee's killing for some reason. Right, I'm gonna make a coffee, I'm gonna text Eddie, and then we're gonna head out. Eddie's just replied, he's on his way over now, so it shouldn't be too long. I'm just thinking, where shall I go next week? I want to go somewhere ridiculous, crazy. I'm not going to do Europe next week, I'm going to go further. I'm going to go out of Europe to somewhere mad next week. Before Eddie comes, I just want to say a big thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video and showing their continued support in me. I'll tell you more about them at the end of the video. Hey, how are you, mate? It's good, how are you? Mate, that is a comfy table. It's bad, isn't it? It's better than my mattress. You won't believe what I got up to yesterday. What? Guinness factory. Did you get in? Snuck straight Did you really? in over the barrier and I kept blagging loads of free drinks. Mate, I was steaming in there. Fair play. I did not think you were going to do it. <laughs> the security is so awesome. Oh, it's it? tight in there. It, yeah. it, no, seriously, it's dead tight in there. But like, I literally sort of snuck under. Oh, no, you'll have to watch the video. Yeah, no, definitely. <laughs> Keep it a surprise. Right, plan for today. I've got four euros 51 left. So the Lewis is two euros 50. So that leaves me with two euros and one. What is the most cost effective way I can get as much food as possible with two euros? I would go to to Tesco's, we go to the discounted area. It is Sunday morning, so you're gonna have loads of items there. Do you reckon? Yeah, I would say so. Do you have any like bakery. pound bakery? No, like I was thinking if there's any like kind of cakes or stuff like that. No, we, not at this, not at this hour. Tesco would be the best show. Not even done stores. There's a whole aisle just on discounted yeah. items, and you're gonna get from from yogurts to cakes to breads. You can get so much items. Ah, sweet. I'll check Tesco. That's probably then. the best bit. But where's the closest Tesco to you? Ten minutes away from here. I'll check that Tesco then definitely. I can't believe you. I'm gonna. Pound Bakery here. Pound Bakery would be amazing now. Is it literally just called Pound Bakery? It's literally just Pound Bakery. And there's everything and you get butties in there for a pound, like sandwiches and everything. So I'm gonna try Tesco for food and then I wanna do a spa me. I'll go on booking.com, I'll see which ones I've got like indoor pools and stuff. The spas are popular in Ireland, but they're always outside of Dublin in the counties and in, yeah. in remote areas and stuff like that. I'm with you. So I'm gonna Google some spas. So we'll go to Tesco, then I'll get the Lewis into town and then try and find a spa and just have a chill day before my flight. But before we go, last game of ping pong? Definitely, yeah. And then I want to do an Instagram live. And we are live. Hey, how's it going, mate? Have you got any questions at all, mate? Was Dublin more difficult or less difficult than other cities? Yeah, I wouldn't say it was like really hard and I wouldn't say it was really easy. I saw you went to your fan to Slovenia, right? Yeah. So are you planning anything like that in the future. Yeah, a hundred percent. And to be honest, I want to do that more often as well because that was so much fun and like doing it with other people yeah. and getting out your comfort zone and stuff. So yeah, hundred percent going to be picking more people moving forward. Does McDonald's taste better free? Mate, try it and find out. Where are you going to travel next? You wait for the next trip. I'm going to go out of Europe. I'm going to do something mad. I've not booked it yet, but it's going to be somewhere ridiculous. Look who it is. How is it like not coming on the next one, mate? It's been horrible. <laughs> At work. Well, we've got a Christmas market at work now. I just put it outside today. I was working this morning and I was like, they might want me to sleep in there. Well, mate, if your missus kicks you out for going on Tinder with me, at least you can sleep in the Christmas market. Right, mate, I'm going to shoot off. Have a good one, mate. Look after yourself. Yeah. See you later, mate. Bye, mate. Thank you so much for letting me stay. <laughs> no problem. That's the thing with the challenges, it's always the sleep. Yeah. So the fact that I've had two good nights sleep in Dublin, it's made a difference to be honest. This is what it's come to. I consider a good night's sleep sleeping on a table tennis table. <laughs> oh, if it's crazy. not the street, it's a good night's sleep. Yeah, as, lo as long as it's a roof, you know. Exactly. Even a Christmas market. <laughs> <laughs> so cold, yeah. isn't it? It's the windier. That's what like th this is what makes this stand out to Slovenia, mate, is just the wind and like how cold it actually yeah. is. We're just on our way to Tesco. See how far this two euros is gonna stretch. 
What do we have in here then? We've got raw fish, brilliant. Raw sausages, brilliant. Oh, perfect. Have you got a pan and a grill back at the table tennis club? Yeah, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> so we found nothing in the reduced to clear. However, check this out. Meal deal for two euros. Two baker's jumbo sausage rolls and spicy wedges. Can I grab the sausage roll? Two euro one. Yeah, but I've no wedges to cubes in there. Is it possible to like swap the wedges for something else then or? No, it's only on a time I can't change. Ah, okay. I can't like have another sausage roll or something like that. Well, it's three sausage rolls for a euro. That's the only bit. Oh, three sausage rolls for a euro. Yeah, I'll just grab six sausage rolls for two euros then, please. Yeah. Right? Thanks. Cheers, mate. Thanks very much. Do you have any ketchup at all? Yeah, I do. Just loose. And okay. I'm ah, you've only got like the bottle. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll just take the bottle. It's fine. <laughs> I'm go. Cheers, mate. Absolute bargain. Six sausage rolls for two euros. I'm actually glad there was nothing in the reducer clear. These sausage rolls are mega. Although it is the first time I've ever had a sausage roll with no ketchup. Just getting to the Lewis stop now. Spent my last two euros 50. And then I'm back to skin me. Right, this is me. Eddie, look after yourself, mate. Well, yeah, good luck in this weather. Yeah. See you later, mate. Thanks Bye. for everything. I'm back in Dublin city centre now, the weather's so bad. Obviously the challenge finishes today. I've not had a shower <laughs> since I got here. I've obviously eaten today, so that's fine. I just want to get a shower now, and maybe just chill out in some spa until I have to get the flight back. Just need to find a really nice one. Right, I've had a look on booking.com to see which hotels have like the facilities, spa facilities, indoor pool, etc. And surprisingly, there's not as many as I thought there'd be in Dublin. It says there's like three in the city centre but they're sort of like dotted about so even though there's three in the city centre they're still like 30 minutes walk away from each other so it's not ideal in the slightest but the first one I'm going to try is just at the bottom of this road right this is it looks quite nice right this looks pretty posh and I've got a clue where I'm going I'm guessing the pool's in the leisure centre, is that? Yes. Yeah, cool, thank you. Have you been to the pool yet? Yeah, yesterday. Is it nice down yeah, there? good one. Ah, good. Is there, like, dressing gowns down there? Yeah. Right, everybody's out the left. It says the leisure centre here is LG. That guy I just asked, he's actually, like, a guest here, and he said everything's downstairs, so fingers crossed. Hey, how are you? You okay? Use the pool? For what? Um, just, like, chill out and stuff. Yeah, you're not taking pictures, eh? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna obviously That's film. <laughs> yeah, no worries. Cheers, mate. Thanks very much. Where's the um, dressing rooms here? You're stuff? staying in the hotel, is it? I am, yeah. Yeah, I just need to sign in, lad. Okay, no worries. Nice so one, mate. Tell for yourself, lad. The yeah. The room's last door on the left. The locker, just take the key. You don't need to put your own in it. Ah, okay, so you don't need... And okay, to get so in, number three on the door. Turn okay. The to the right. Where can I, like, do some work on the laptop and stuff like that? Down here? Yeah. You can either sit on the seats. Ah, okay. I'll wish. do that first if that's yeah. alright, mate. Yeah, nice one, mate. Get in. First attempt, and we've done it. Right, let's check this place out. So it's not bad, it's not the poshest, but, you know, I'm not complaining. We've got, like, the sinks over there, locker rooms there, and over here, the showers. No curtain, everybody's gonna see my ass. Then if you come through here... Yeah, I think the pool's this way. So we've got sauna, steam room. Yeah, so basically the sauna, steam room, pool, and everything's over there. I am gonna get a shower, go in the pool, and chill out. Nice one, mate. See you later. Fresh hair for the first time in this challenge. Just need to get out of here now. Oh, I needed that. That was a good way to end my time in Dublin. And I can now just be fresh for the flight home. Talking about the flight, I have spent far too long in there, so now I'm rushing to catch it. So I'm gonna have to give you my thoughts on Dublin as I walk. But before I do that, I just wanna thank Squarespace again. If you don't know anything about Squarespace, it's a great all-in-one platform where you can use its award-winning design template to create your own website, blog, or even an online shop. It's a great way to start a side business and it's really easy to use. Also, it offers domains if you haven't got 
got one, like I've got skinstuff.com for my online shop. Go check out squarespace.com slash Simon Wilson, I'll put it on the screen as well, it's also in the description. You get a free trial and 10% off your first purchase. Right, Dublin, my thoughts on Dublin. Literally nearly missed my flight then, so I had to run. I've only ever missed one flight in my life to Iceland. That was nearly the second, but we're all good. So, Dublin. I can't recommend Dublin enough. The people are great. They've got good banter, they're helpful, they're just nice people. On top of that, it's a beautiful city, and there's like so much fun things to do, like Temple Bar, going for a pint. You know, that's an experience within itself. Then you've got the Guinness factory, and someone's saying about the Jameson's distillery as well. There's just so much to do. In in terms of negatives, I wouldn't really say that there is any negatives. If anything, I'd say that there is a homeless problem here, but I wouldn't say it's any bigger than the one in London, to be honest. If anything, the London one's bigger. In terms of this challenge, I feel like I've done a fair bit, but at the same time, I feel like there was a lot more I could have done and obviously met a lot more people and stuff, but there's only so much you can fit in in three days. Obviously, I've got to find somewhere to sleep and try and earn money as well, so it just gives me a really good excuse to come back. So I'm going to be back soon, 100%. Next week, Week, we're 100% going out of Europe and we're gonna do something nuts. I wanna like really take this to the next level, but I am literally at the gate now, so have a good one, and I'll see you Monday at 8 p.m.